Stearman, did you do air shows? Uh, air shows weren't a thing in those days. Mm -hmm. I taught people, I, I read a book on acrobatics. And before I had the Stearman, I was also flying a T-6. And nobody would teach me how to fly that T-6. Now, I had flown my Stearman before I bought it, and I was teaching people how to take off and land in it because we just checked people out in it, like you check people out in 150s today to go fly a Stearman or a Waco. I had a U, uh, in my school a UPF-7. And they had this AT-6, 600 horsepower. Nobody knew how to check Wally out in this airplane. So I would get in it and I would taxi up and down the runway and the taxiway until I felt real confident. Then I went over and I got the mechanic and I said, hey, sit in the back, Joe. Don't let me over rev this engine because it couldn't go past a certain RPM. He said, okay. And I took that T6 off at Hawthorne, California airport and I took it off and it was just as beautiful and perfect and about when I was starting to turn crosswind, I thought, holy moly, I've got to get this thing back on the runway. Hadn't thought about that part. Well, I decided to make a 45 and go out over the beach and do some, you, you can do acrobatics in a T6, but you don't want to spin it. And I love to spin airplanes with people if they wanted to know how to do it. So I knew, I was told early, don't ever spin a T6 because you might not get it out. So I went over the beach, over Palos Verdes, and uh, did some acrobatics and some turns and kind of get used to the airplane, because it, it was a big, heavy airplane. And those were what those wasps were flying. Good for them. And I decided, OK, it's time. <laughs> you know, you check the gas and fill up the oil in that airplane, because it uses a lot of oil. <laughs> I decided it's time to come back into the traffic pattern and make that landing. So I told the guy sitting in the back, I said, OK, I can't see the runway very well. Keep watching to see that I've got this, this edge going on either side of the runway, because it was thin. And to my amazement, I just came on down. I floated it out. Came back on the stick, little by little by little by little, just like I did the Stearman. I kissed it on. Rolled it out, and everybody down at Wright's Flying Service was giving me a hand. And then I got to check other people out in the, in the T6. 